this one is in its fourth stage so it's just like a poop just like a poop and they live on lemon trees or orange trees and this is its fifth stage what is they it begin doing? it's cleaning its place to eat if it has water it drinks the water and after it molts its fourth stage it becomes the fifth stage and they like to climb on trees and branches and the leaf how many lemon trees they eat per day they eat like a half of the tree or 5 or 10 or 15 leaves yes they eat 15 or 8 or 10 uh-huh. and they are very smooth when they are in its fifth stage and they have two wrong eyes they can see from their eyes yes they have two eyes it's like just like a one a one cut on its head and it has two wrong eyes just on its body what is it doing over there now it's cleaning its poop they clean their poop they like to be clean and as you know they are very soft when they are in its fifth stage you can walk on a, even a, on a plastic yes yes so now it's eating it's eaten and eating became the cocoon so it's so big and long it will be fat as your thumb finger and it will be long as your daddy finger what what are these uh, black dots are its stripes it has two stripes or five this guy has three stripes stage now it's almost going to hatch from that place so can you see it's black and its heads are a little bit brown you see so nice so it's close to be hatch you see head is a little bit green and you can see its feathers black so its name is the citrus volatile caterpillar the citrus volatile caterpillar giant volatile caterpillar zebra volatile caterpillar and there's lots of types of caterpillars in the lemon trees or in other types i can see the white dots uh, over there on that cocoon because in their wings they have white dots in their sideways and they have a white belly but under their belly it's white and up is black so it's fully black final stage yes it's its final stage second it became the butterfly Ooh, surprise So you see it's a citrus swallowtail caterpillar. How to define it's a citrus or giant swallowtail because the giant swallowtail is brown and it doesn't has the stripe pattern. And they always just and comes to green as they molt. As they molt they are just like a poop. And you can see because the citrus swallowtail is a little bit small but the giant swallowtail is big. It's just for now it seems Yes, they just bone so they're a little bit small when they bone like your hand but the cocoon so small can you see the cocoon and the butterfly so how to define it's a female or a male the female has white dots and it has only white dots but the boy you can find if it's the boy it might have a one red dot on its body the feathers You mean male, right? Yeah. The female so, has the yellow. You you're going to uh, send it away? Yeah. So it's a little bit wet, so it just came from the cocoon. It's very noon, so it a little bit rest in because it will air in the morning. Until the feathers dry. Yeah. Because when it's closed in the morning until the noon, it's a little bit wet. So after it becomes a little bit sweat it climbs the plastic and try to fly. It's beautiful. Yeah. So can you tell me is it a female or a male? It's a male. No, a female. And so how do you define that? Because they have a yellow dot. The boy has a red dot. You see? 
how did they find it has an antenna because in front of their eyes there is an antenna and their super sense is behind their eyes down their eyes there is a hole from that they can smell out where is the honey everything that is their super sense the giant swallow tails every swallow tail has two two dots behind their feathers you see that two dots like a round shape yes yes that's how we define it it's a swallow tail have type. you named this butterfly yes what i have it? named it it's the slow bow i named it because when it's small it was walking slow second it became a butterfly now so it's quick oh beautiful thank you so much mm. i learned a lot yeah so can you see it for a little so bye bye thanks for watching